video welcome back to vietnam 70 more miles of the ho chi minh trail today elevation profile of today's ride is looking pretty lumpy no major standout climbs just quite aggressive rollers all day it's lovely and sunny which means it's going to be very hot so at least the climbs won't be too long probably going to get chased by dogs probably going to get rained on at some point seven more rides till we hit saigon one two three let me step into the moon so we're covering pretty good ground today looks like at midday we would have done half the ride which is much quicker than yesterday because we haven't had all the elevation it is lumpy but we've got a serious tailwind as well so just making everything a lot easier we're also feeling a lot better now it's a couple of days down the road since the food poisoning spirits are high i am hungry though i don't really fancy noodles it's gonna be noodles again for lunch hey good sun's out looking at the elevation this morning i was a bit worried but actually it's not too bad is it well, you say that, but it's, it's all at the end. Yesterday it was all at the start, and today it's all up at the finish. But you know, we have half the climbing of yesterday, so it should be should be relatively smoothly go. I mean, we've done 55 kilometers in two hours. Better than most days. <laughs> Better than yesterday, that's for sure. Legs feeling a little bit tired after yesterday's exploits, but all good. I had a shave this morning. You were racing trucks. That was a problem. Yeah. Chasing after motor vehicles is uh, fun, but also taxing. Thanks, bro. No problem. Bro. Sponsor us, please. James has decided just to carry on. Hope he's okay. I think he's all right. It's just like the heat gets to him, doesn't it? But and carrying on is smart. He did say. He did say we'll stop at like half twelve, and it's only half eleven. So get out the heat of the day, have some lunch, and then uphill to the finish. So we lost James, we carried on on this road. Turns out this road is actually not on the route. The proper route goes through the city. He might have gone through a city because we ain't caught him up unless he's riding really, really fast. But we've been riding quite hard. We haven't seen him for a while. That's it. And then there were two. We are fairly sustainable, so we didn't actually need him. Oh, uh, okay. The fact that he's booked our hotels for the next three nights. And he's got all my money because I gave it to him this morning. Oh. Hey, the wobbles got worse. I need to redo my front bar back, but I just can't be asked. The only way to steady it is by doing that. What with your legs? Yeah, like support the top shoe. I will have this one, please. Yeah, this. Yeah. Your favourite, mate. Yay. It's the sort of thing that is only faster than you going up a hill. But I'm flat on the descent. We keep getting stuck riding with those things because they over we overtake them and then they overtake us and then it just keeps going, doesn't it? Come Thank on. You. Thank you. Oh, there they go. Noodles. Mm -hmm. um. I this is the first piece of meat I've seen you turn down. That's because it's not meat, mate. It's a piece of vertebrae. Thank you. You've put it on my vegan pile of meal. It's not vegan anymore, then, is it? The bit that you can see is, that looks like meat is meat. But the rest of it is bone and gristle and fat. That's just what it's like here. They do the same in China. Yeah. They put the bones in it with it. We're going to go find Lawrence a hammock, aren't we? Well, yeah, I think so. We're, um... Because we're so ahead of schedule, we're going to try and find somewhere to just chill out, uh, get out of the midday sun for a little bit. Ideally a place with hammocks, because there's quite a few of those around. The opposite for place is now full of people. It's not good sign. Yeah. I feel a bit seasick, it's a bit weird. Yeah, you just sat in it. Come on. Yeah, I, I think we'll be back before dark. Should we leave our bikes here and just take them? Fucking Well, what about them over there? Uh, There's a pink one for Loz. It's 
very hot, but we're going to get the cloud. Any second. Any minute now. Any minute now. Love it. It's cloudy, we pray for sun. It's sunny, we pray <laughs> for cloud. The weather's just Changeable. extreme. Yeah. Well, 30 degrees is too hot to ride a bike. Way too hot. Especially one that weighs this much. About 10 k to go now. Today's ride was just what we needed. We were all feeling a bit cooked after yesterday. We woke up, saw the sun was shining. Wind's been in our favor. It's been perfect. We're gonna get back a lot earlier than we planned. A bit of a chill in the hotel. And actually enjoy a little bit of rest time. Catch up some bits of work as well. I've been overtaken, playing with the line of fire. Patient in the pain, waiting but the stakes get high. We've got the Duck Long Hotel too. If this is number two, imagine what number one looked like. Massage and Zong. What's Zong? That's not bad, is it? Look, we've got a drone launching pad as well. That is pretty good. First of all, it's a bit shoddy, but... All the buildings are painted the same colour. Should we show the viewers the state of the road that we drove in on? I mean, look at it. Right, we, we actually had a relatively clean, dry ride today. And that's the road we came in on just before we get to the hotel. It's hard enough We're trying to keep bikes our bikes clean. the hotel yeah. and we have to come through that shit. Supermarket hall, video time. You're never gonna guess what I found. What'd you get? I got you fake Pringles. Nice, the nice. original flavor. Yeah. And I also bought you one and a half liters of Coke and I bought you a hat. There you go. Thanks guys. It's all right. You buy um, Lay's, which is Walker's, like Pringle ripoff. Perfectly right? good packet. Same, same size tube and everything as a Pringles tube. But there's one small catch. They're half the fucking size. Arseholes. And in another packet inside the packet. Why is it so noisy? Because it's Vietnam. You, you look beyond the city, it is absolutely breathtaking here. I mean, like the mountains in the background, it's, it's a really clear day today as well, so you can actually see it. Lawrence and I were <laughs> saying earlier, you know, kind of walked out here, looked around and went, it's a bit shit. Take a picture of it and all of a sudden it's like, oh, actually, you, you kind of- The city's you, come to life at night. So as you may have gathered, we're a little bit fed up of eating noodles. Not that we don't like noodles, but it's kind of every meal has to be rice noodles or a little bun thing. We may have found a solution, maybe. That is not noodles. And I am very pleased about this. <laughs> Lawrence liked his pizza so much, he bought more for lunch tomorrow. <laughs> Strapping this to my bike. This is gonna be my breakfast, lunch, and dinner tomorrow. Maybe even the day after that. You and me paid for it. He can't have any though. Yeah, yeah, that's true, yeah. I love noodles. <laughs> I wish the viewers could see your face. <laughs> <laughs> I love noodles. But James, you don't eat cold pizza, so that's real for me. In this world of noodle and rice, I will make an exception. Rice, anyone? 